2611 mastermind and jamaat ud dawa chief hafiz said had on august 8 filed a petition in the lahore high court seeking a ban on the release of kabir khan's upcoming film phantom in pakistan alleging that it contains filthy propaganda against the country and reacting on this team phantom organized a press conference in mumbai to address the issue watch here it's not the point the point is that there is a certain representation of the film that's happening there is a, a, a person the person who is talking about it we are just finding it very amusing that a person like that would actually go to the extent of going to the court and uh, you know saying that the film is spreading poison i mean he needs to look at what his position has been what he represents he represents hate agenda he represents hate politics uh, so for somebody like him you know one of the most wanted terrorists in the world to uh, come up and say this about our film is just something that we find i find really amusing friends it's hilarious that a man a wanted terrorist like hafiz said has approached lahore high court seeking a ban on the movie imagine this ban is a wanted terrorist by united states united kingdom european union australia and india now just now i was telling kabir ke don ko 11 mulkon ki film dhoond uh, police dhoond rahi hai hafiz said ko 50 mulkon ki police dhoond rahi hai there is a pending red corner notice against him united states has declared a bounty of 10 million dollars on this man our very top pakistani official says that a free hafiz said is a security threat to pakistan and this ban goes and seek a ban against the movie saying that it's spewing venom against pakistan he has not even seen the movie he might have only seen the trailer but he is trying to represent pakistan imagine a man a wanted terrorist like who can be credited with the innocent blood of thousands and thousands of people is representing pakistan i'm sure i mean pakistani government or pakistani people does not want to be represented by this kind of terrorist but he has come forward and he has sort of ban against the movie so i mean you guys decide i think pakistan should decide whether he should be allowed to speak on their behalf or not put under house arrest twice and after 2000 attacks in december 19 he was arrested he was put under house arrest for a year and a half two cases were filed against him and it went into the supreme court so there is also a pending red corner notice uh, issued against him by united states they have also placed a bounty of 10 million dollars against him if he is not a wanted criminal as i said in the beginning that it's united states united kingdom australia european union everyone is like trying to hunt for this man so he is not a criminal he is a terrorist not a criminal he is a terrorist